Today we got South Park 1%. If you want to watch my reaction to the entire episode, the link to my Patreon is in the description below. Y'all ready for this one? Let's run it, baby. Let's get it. Let's go. Last week, the students of this school participated in the presidential fitness test. Huh? I'm sad to announce that South Park Elementary scored the lowest in health and fitness in the entire country. Ooh. But what the hell is a, is a presidential fitness test? One fourth grader at this school scored so low with a terrifying body fat score oh. and high blood pressure and the cholesterol levels of a 70-year-old man <laughs> oh that actually my brought God. your entire school's average down to the lowest in the country. Bro, is this whole episode about to be about fat shaming Cartman? I'm with it, bro. I'm not against it. You feel me? My man's got to get what's coming to him for all the dirt he's ever done. So as far as we're concerned, you're all a bunch of fat pigs. <laughs> oh, my God. All right. Fourth grade class, you're up first. We're going to do some rope climbing. God, this sucks. Bro, I never did a rope climbing in school. I don't know if I missed school the day that we were supposed to do it, but I never did rope climbing, bro. I don't remember anyone ever talking about it. None of that. Well, let's just suck it up, guys. All we can try to do is have a positive attitude about it. No, shut your f ass up. It's your fault everybody's doing it in the first place, bro. <laughs> Look at Kenny. He's so poor, huh, you guys? His family's so poor they couldn't pay the three ninety nine for the gym outfit. All right, let's go, bro. Flosky. Oh, I just caught that. He doesn't have his PE clothes, bro. My man's just working out in his big ass jacket. <laughs> Look, you guys, a G on a rope. You know what they call a G on a rope? All right, Cartman, stop ripping on other people to make yourself feel less embarrassed about the fact we're all here because of you. Mm -hmm. and whoa. Talk your s*** and let him know. Because my man's trying to act like he's all cool, calm, and collected. When he knows deep inside, my man's is embarrassed. Like, he doesn't want to go to the... He, he doesn't want to climb that rope in front of everybody. Would you? You feel me? If you was the fattest kid in class... Absolutely not, dog. Here we were having a perfectly nice conversation about Kenny being poor and Kyle being a Jew, and you just decide to go 9-11 and bust out the fat quip. We oh are here God. because of you, Eric, so just keep your mouth shut. Oh, my God. Why doesn't everyone just back off? I know how this works. You're the 99% ganging up on the 1%. Why don't you go home and cry to your stuffed animals again? <gasps> oh, damn. <laughs> he really does that? <laughs> You soft ass SpongeBob body bag, bro. What? I bet you his mom is gonna like nurture him too. Like, oh, it's okay, so oh, you're not even fat. You know what I'm saying? She's gonna put a bandaid over the problem rather than find a solution for the kid. It's not your fault, Eric. How can they blame you for what is clearly President Obama's fault? <laughs> you didn't make that stupid presidential fitness test. Obama did. Yeah, that's right, Eric. You don't need to grow up. You are awesome and key. Yo, his lack of accountability is crazy. I've never seen anybody like that before. Probably because this is a cartoon, bro, but I wouldn't be surprised if there are people out there like that. <laughs> and so then, Skeletor told Terminator he wanted a divorce, and apparently it's all going to be fun as soon. Dude, Butters, how many times do we have to go over this? That's not Skeletor. That's a woman named Maria Shriver. <laughs> but, and why does your face look like that? What? 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 Bro, you slammed the shit out that door when you walked in the room. You know what I'm saying? Like you walked in like your parents try to walk in on you, catch you doing some shit you're not supposed to be doing. You feel me? And then you act surprised when it gets quiet. I mean, everybody heard that loud ass thump with you opening the door. What are you guys talking about? What are you guys doing? What are you talking about? You try to catch him talking. You guys are having a big 99% rally, aren't you? Occupying the cafeteria? You want to know why you guys are all here protesting? Because you're pissed off, but you actually think it's wrong to be pissed off at a black president, so you're all just pissed off at me. What well, go the ahead. fuck? Have your little rally to figure out how to stick it to the 1%. See what it gets you. Hey, you know, Eric is right. Maybe we should form a 99% club. Yeah, it's not a bad idea. If all the students unite, we can work together to fight this system. Yeah, the fifth graders agree. We're all being punished for one lazy Let's make him suffer. Yes. All we need is some good old-fashioned diplomacy. 
Hello, sir. We are here on behalf of all fourth graders at South Park Elementary. Ah, yes, the Fatty Bumbaladi class. How's fatty the extra PE treating is crazy. You? Sir, we believe your fitness system is flawed, and that for 99% of us, it is unfair. And what do you want me to do about it? Well, sir, we believe that the 1% should be dropped from the fitness results so that our scores can be more accurate. <sighs> Afraid that's impossible. The National Fitness Test has very specific standards. No one child can ever be made to feel singled out. We don't even like to use the term physically fit anymore because it can make a student feel unphysically fit, and then that student might end up feeling like a total... Excuse me, can you use a different terminology, please? <laughs> and then that fourth grader might end up... Yo, he is ignoring my man's bro. Like, like he didn't just say a word. He didn't want to. He didn't want to be used. You feel me? Or he didn't want being used. There we go. That that sounds better. Mom, have you been here all day? No, sweetie. I've been at the hair salon. Why? Somebody's been in my room. Ninety-nine percenters. What did they take? Are you sure, sweetie? Am I sure? Look at this place. But who would want to... Don't you get it, Mom? People voted for Obama, so now that everything sucks, they have to blame me! Hey, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, bro. I don't think... I, I could be wrong, right? But I don't think anybody went in there and, and did that. I think um, he did that himself. Because he's, he's, he's so stuck in that victim mentality. It's everybody else's fault, not mine. You know what I mean? Blame Obama. That I think he played all of this out to believe it himself and have a, a better back and forth with the 99 percent you feel me oh my god Can I throw? what no no oh they took the frog but well, the frog is missing on the they took cotton bone yep That's some movie shit right there, though, bro. That's definitely some movie shit right there. But you know what? I don't know. He went straight out to, like, where the frog is at. But the kids did declare war. You feel me? So that might be what's really going on. I've known Clad Frog since I was two years old. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. So you invite the people that you're beefing with to the uh, the viewing, bro? Like, how does how does that make sense? Why would you want the people that you think probably killed them there? You feel me? He never said anything. He never had his own ideas about what he wanted to do. He just <laughs> sat there going along with whatever I wanted. A noble trait that seems lost on you, 99 percenters. And that's why he that's why he rocks with Butters. Because he can tell Butters whatever the hell he wants and Butters is going to go with it. Well, whoever you are, I'm sure you're sitting there right now in your little green hat. With your left cheek resting against your hand, thinking, I'm not getting away with this, am I? Because whoever you are, maybe you still have one little piece of humanity left, covered up and tainted black by years of Jewish propaganda and left-wing lies. Maybe you should have up, Cartman. Yes! Fly, fly, little Jeff, to the welcome arms of Christ above. Your tears are finally gone. Where's our five dollars? Fly, what? It said in the email if we came, we each got five dollars. Yeah. Oh. Five dollars has been donated in each of your names to the Clyde's Law Foundation. Blah, blah. Ah! <laughs> He's so full of sh bro. You know what though, man? Like the way all of these characters are, like, especially Cartman. I would love to see like a real life South Park movie. You know what I'm saying? Like, I want to see how they bring these characters to life. Cause this is this is just bananas, bro. Like how extra this dude Cartman is, how he goes above and beyond to be obnoxious, to be a little piece of You know what I'm saying? I would like to see how that plays out in person. Thank you all so much for coming. I realize that Clyde Frog's death is as shocking to all of you as it is to me. Why would somebody do such a terrible thing? Why would somebody hurt Clyde Frog, Eric? Especially because you are so awesome and key. We all know who fucking killed Clad Frog, and she's the same dirty slut who's been f***ing with us our whole life. Shut your fat pile! Yeah, you know what you did. You let Clad Frog get murdered. Bro, my mom will slap the shit out of me just for talking to her like that and pretending to be the toys that's, <laughs> that's doing it, you feel me? No, Rumper Tumskin, I didn't. I swear. Then why did you write in your diary it was probably time for Eric to grow out of his stuffed animals anyway? 
Who is this guy supposed to be? Can y'all let me know in the comments, bro? I have no idea. That's an excellent point, Muscle Man Mark. Please continue. Muscle Man well, Mark. All I'm saying, Eric, is that... Sweetie, you really can just talk to me if you... All I'm saying, Eric, is that you went through your mom's diary for a reason. The protest has quadrupled in size since this morning. As you can see from this aerial photograph, the protest now covers almost two square miles. We have riot officers here, here, and here. The media has been contained to this area. And where are the actual protesters? Oh, these two people right here. How are we going to contain this thing? <laughs> Is that a fire, bro? Oh, how? Why? Who? What the hell? Ah! Mom! Mom, my room is... Ah! Peter, Peter! The fire started with this. Definitely a case of arson. Somebody hates this kid. Don't you touch him! Leave him alone! Peter, Peter! Don't try to talk to Peter Panda. You're going to be okay. This is what is... His mental health is, is, is not right. You feel me? Hey, dude. Are you the guys messing with Cartman's stuffed animals? Maybe we are and maybe we aren't. You got any proof? Well, it's just you and your friends were the ones saying Cartman needs to suffer. That doesn't prove anything. That fat little f is finally getting what's coming to him. I yeah, agree. Dude, he seriously could have died in that fire. He's in I, your that's class. That's true. But you don't deal with him. So we are going to remedy the situation. We've got big plans. Just oh. stay out of our way and let the men handle this. Let the men handle this? <laughs> Excuse me, gangsta. Who is that kid, bro? Who are they? I don't know who they are. This window locks from the inside, right? And this door has a lock on it, too? Don't worry, Polly Pussy Pants. You're going to be safe here. In this day and age, black people are just impervious to being with, so we will be all right. Why are you helping <laughs> me in this? Okay. Token, please. You're the only person I can trust. Because in today's time, black people are somehow incapable of doing anything wrong. Bro, eating on his bed is crazy. That's disrespectful as hell. Will you stop changing channels and just pick something? Right. What do you want to watch, Polly Pissy Pants? This is my room. I'll take the remote from you. Nah, -uh, cause I'll tell my mom on you when our parents get home. My house got burned down, so everyone has to feel bad for me. What is that? What is that? That's the alarm that someone's in the backyard. What? Oh, Move! Sh I don't know. I thought I was safe here! Stay there, guys. I'll be right back. Who's there? Lock that door behind you, Token. Black people live here! <laughs> <Move to you. laughs> Who is it, bro? <laughs> oh, it's Kyle! Hey, what the f- cap? It's not me! I'm here to help you, fat ass! We came to keep an eye out. Stephen Tamil said he had something really big planned. Stephen Tamil? The fifth grader? Lock that door, Token! Yeah, he did, he did. Yep. No! no, 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 no. <laughs> Where are they, Keely? I don't trust any of you assholes! Where are you, sons of bitches? This is it. The inevitable has happened at Occupy Red Robin. It is full on class. Oh warfare. shit, they're scrapping, bro! Come on, Butters, beat his ass! Apparently, it is the fourth grade class versus the fifth grade class. Go ahead, class. Jimmy, go ahead, Jimmy! Yeah, class warfare is finally here! Yeah! Hello? Whoever you are, just give them back! Haven't you done enough to me? Muscle Man Mark! Ah! Oh no! Ah! Jesus Christ! Hey, don't come at Yo! Don't you wouldn't let anything happen to us! Don't worry, I'll get you down! No, Eric, don't come at it! Ah Bro, who's with him they hate him and they hate him bad it's okay eric it's over now i called it bro i called it from the beginning why the f this kid needs to see a doctor asap this dude is not right up here at all you got rid of clyde Fra. you burnt peter panda yes they're gone and now we can grow up and be together what are they gonna say about friends? this they were holding us back! All the kids making fun of you at school! Saying you're not cute! Your stuffed animals all had to be gotten rid of, don't you see? Deadbolted token! Token, you in there? You say I had to grow up to get rid of all my dolls. You forget one crucial thing, Polly Pissy Pants. 
that nobody would possibly blame Token for all this because in today's day and age you can't blame a black person for anything. <laughs> You're totally right! But I thought my plan was perfect! I failed! I failed you! You have to kill me, Lyric, so that you don't get blamed! Goodbye, Polly Pissy Pants. I love you. Say it better be a real gun, though. <laughs> oh, it is a real gun. <laughs> Dude, what the hell? <laughs> he told him to grow up. So he got rid of his stuffed animals. My little Eric can sometimes be a bit dramatic. <laughs> a bit dramatic, bro? You enabler? He damn near burnt your house down, bro. But I want an explanation on how. All right. So y'all remember when the alarm went off that there was somebody in the back or whatever, or the motion sensors? And him and Token left, and the toys stayed on the bed. How did the toys move to. You know what I'm saying? To getting tied up and all of that when we were watching Cartman the whole time. Occupy Red Robin is over. Class warfare has torn apart the 99% and replaced it with the 30%, the 26%, and even little brackets of 5% here and there. <laughs> what does this mean for our country? What does this mean for me? Get down to State Street! They're occupying Macaroni Grill! Oh, hell yeah! I'll occupy me some goat cheese pepperdew peppers! Macaroni Grill is fire, though, I'm not gonna lie! Now, this was crazy, bro. I didn't I didn't know what to expect going into it into it. You feel me, but Carmen is 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 crazy, bro. Like my man needs help. You feel me? But listen, I appreciate you pulling up and watching this video with me. If you enjoyed it, you know what to do. Go on and smash that like button. Smash that subscribe button if you haven't yet and join the family. If you want to watch full South Park episode reactions, Rick and Morty, all that good stuff, go ahead and click this link right here to take you straight to my Patreon. If you want to just support on YouTube, which I'm cool with too, man, because I appreciate you supporting me. So love. I got a whole playlist of South Park reaction videos, over 200 uploads. 200! Go ahead and click that. It's right here. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.